Hey, did you have a good week? This is Shenshan from Century 21 FM Realty. Bring you more news from the real estate market. First up is the unemployment rate. As we can see here on the chart, the rate has been going down. Although the last week, it has gone up a little bit. And secondly, let's look into the mortgage that has gone into forbearance. Forbearance is when your mortgage servicer or your lender allows you to pay a portion of the mortgage with a promise to pay it back later or allows you to pause some of the payment. It was initially forecasted that 30% of the mortgage will go into forbearance. We can see that it wasn't the case. Currently, we have 7.2% of mortgages that has gone into forbearance. And in fact, a quarter of these are still being paid. And if you do need more time, you can request with CFPB for extension up to 180 days. It was predicted that with the pandemic, we're going to have a lot of foreclosures, which is actually not true. We're experiencing record low foreclosure right now. With a low interest rate, shoppers are actually able to afford about 10% more than they could have one year ago. And that translates to uh, about $32,000 in increased buying powers. Of course, if you're buying a house or if you're selling then buy another one, you can still choose to buy the same type of house that you wanted and save the money instead. Although the interest rates are low right now, it could go up, it could go down, and no one can really predict it. So it's really tricky and you cannot really time it. Um, for example, if you're buying a house, um, you usually cannot lock in the interest rate until you have a signed purchase agreement, which is a signed offer that both party agrees on the price. Like I said before, that the price may not be coming down due to the tight inventory and the buyers nowadays are getting really close to 99% to 100% what they want. So um, if you're in the market of buying a house, it's really time to do it um, when the rate is still low. When the inventory is tight and you cannot find exactly what you want on the market, a good way to rectify that is to have your house built. And we have many great builders in Fargo Moorhead area, uh, such as Jordo Custom Home, there's Brookstone, um, Heritage Homes, uh, Thompson Homes, JNL. These builders are more than willing to help you to get a house exactly the way that you want it. And of course, with most real estate transactions, you're going to need a realtor on your side to make sure that everything's carried out, whatever that the builder promised in all the documentation. Was that helpful? There are lots of conflicting information out there, but that's what we're here for. I know the buying selling process could be confusing and downright stressful. That's why I'm here. Just give me a shout if you have any question or need any help. This is Shan Shan from Century 21 FM Realty. Now see you soon in another video.